Hello ladies and gents, welcome back to episode number four of the Manchester United beta save on FN24. What a jam-packed episode this is. Two massive Premier League games against Manchester City and Arsenal, a huge Champions League group game, and Harry Maguire goes in goal. Yeah, that happened. If you enjoy the video at any point, make sure you hit that like button down below and of course subscribe for more episodes. Also, check out the description for the TikTok and the Twitch links where these episodes are recorded live. Mondays, Tuesdays and Thursdays, we go live on both platforms at the same time. So if you want to watch the save live, the games that don't go onto YouTube, and also listen to some good tunes and just have a chat about football, the links in the description description down below. Played three games since we were last on YouTube. West Ham, we lost 2-1 away, mainly because we got an injury to Andre Onana and Harry Maguire went in goal. It was, it was an experience. Oh no. I haven't got a goalkeeper on the bench. I haven't got a goalkeeper on the bench. I haven't got a goalkeeper on the bench. I think it's the only logical solution here. I think it's got to be Maguire in goal, isn't it? Slabhead has got it in net. It, yeah, it'll just head everything away. We'll be fine. I mean, he's not been a sweeper keeper, that's for sure. He's going to play a whole half in goal. I feel like he's far too high there, Harry. Remember where your goal is. Remember you're playing in goal. Imagine if he just comes out and headers it away. That would be quite funny. What a save. What a save. Never in doubt. Yes, Maguire. You can't teach that. I mean, Ward Prowse is pretty good from corners, isn't he? <sighs> Harry Maguire. Then we scraped past Luton Town, a 3-2 win. I've just beaten Feyenoord 4-2. So things are okay. It's not going too bad. Looking at the league, that's left us in eighth place. Nine games played, 18 points. Man City and Arsenal, two huge tests, which will go a long way to seeing where we will end up come the end of the season. The Sancho's just played one of the Champions League, so he's probably got to start. Hoyland scored when he came on. Rashford didn't play very well. I'm struggling to get people to really click in this in this roll up here. Of course, Alte's in goal because Onana's is still injured. We're going to prioritise the and get Wampa Saka in there as well and stop him overlapping. I kind of fancy us to nick a little counter-attacking win away at City, you know. And that's a mad thing to say. But I back us counter-attacking. I really do. Here we go. Right at the Etihad. Look at the amount of fans we're bringing. Did you see that, man? This is a big, 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 big game. They're playing a false nine with Foden up top. Where is Haaland? Nothing's happened in 30 minutes. This is a bit weird, isn't it? Oh, no. Kevin De Bruyne from a free kick. It doesn't look like this will end well, this. Oh, he's hit the bar. Is that all that's going to happen in the first half? Okay. Nearly at half time. I mean, it's okay, right? I tell you what, there's been one highlight in this whole game. Rodri's playing as libero and centre-back for these. Should I be pushing a bit more? Is this a weak Man City side that I should be beating here? Oh yeah, Kanji's right back as well. This Man City team is not good. Second highlight of the whole game. We're going to concede, aren't we? I have no faith in us whatsoever. Here we go, Garnacho. Maybe I should have faith in the boys. Have we got a goal in us? I don't know if we do. Martial, you've just come on. I've just made a lot of changes, to be fair. Oh, wow, Martial. Calvin Phillips is playing. This is unrealistic. Kovacic is in. Oh, he's at the bar. Oh, my days. They've had nine shots to our four. Do we escape with a point here? Ooh. And that's full time. Not really much happening in that game, to be honest. Again, though, we are getting battered at the moment. I don't really know what's going on. In terms of stats, 14 shots to our six, three on target to our one. I think we take the point and get out of there. I kind of feel like with a team playing Rodri at centre half and a Kanji at fullback. Two invert fullbacks, by the way. And a, and a Libera. That's so weird. We are struggling scoring goals. I don't know if we have to go a bit more adventurous. Okay, this is the team we're going to go for. Arsenal away. Hoyland's back in as well. Casemiro's back in because of Amorat's injury. I'm going to keep Wambasaka there just because defensively, he's probably a little bit more solid than Dalo. It probably makes sense, especially if we play him on a wing-back defense. Sancho's back in the team. Now he's in. Now he's free from injury again. He's doing bits. What are we saying about the Arsenal kit here? Is it a dub or an L? I'm not really sure. Why do we not create any chances, by the way? Every game that I've played today, there's been... It's taken a long time since we've seen the first highlight. Okay, we've got the ball. Everyone's in the Arsenal half. Does this mean we now lose it and concede to a counter-attack? Absolutely. Let's see what happens here. Casemiro turns. What a ball over the top. Hoyland's in. Finish. Oh! Oh, is he offside? That's really sad. Because that's... No, 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 no. I don't agree. I don't agree. They've ruled out They've ruled out the best goal I've scored in FM so far. Where is that line being drawn there? Surely he is further back than Hoyland. I need a different angle. Is he off? He's maybe slightly ahead of Saliba there, isn't he? Oh, that's disgusting. Disgusting. We'll encourage the boys after that. Come on, Hoyland. We've got this. They haven't been beating yet, Arsenal, so it'd be quite a feat to go and beat them. I feel like we might be better against better teams, though. So we beat Liverpool on the opening day. We lost against Spurs and Newcastle, I think. And then we've just drawn to Man City. So we're kind of we're kind of even, really. That's a good little ball. Hoyland's in again. Finish that one. A little deep free kick from Reguion. Go on, then, lad. Why is it taking so long to do my encourage as well? I said that ages ago. What happened there? What's going on? Rashford. Sancho! Oh! off the post. It's been a good half from the boys, that. Still nil-nil. We've hit the post. We've had a goal ruled out. We're doing okay here. Very, Just very defensive. What a tackle. That's from Hoyland. The hunger to win the ball back. 
Go on, Rashford. Hoyland! You couldn't have missed that by any more. I was just dancing to yes or I can boogie and he's, he's nearly snuck one in at the near post for a free kick. 10 minutes to go. Don't make this two 0 nil draws for the YouTube video. Like this is this is bad. Are they gonna score Jorginho? They don't deserve it. They don't deserve it. They don't deserve it. They don't deserve it. They don't Roberto deserve it. Oh, and Havertz has scored. Come on, Fernandez. 85th minute. We need to go from somewhere. We do not deserve to lose this man. After the first half we had, they've had one highlight, and that was that one. And to be fair, the free kick. But they, they shouldn't be winning. Come on, Fernandez. Why does it take him so long to take free kicks in, in the in this version? I thought he'd slotted it top bins. I thought it was beautiful. This is a damaging loss if we lose this. Anthony whips it in. Headed away. Fernandez pick it up. Good touch. Good touch, Fernandez. Yes, yes, yes. Fernandez all the way. Why didn't he shoot? Why didn't he shoot? I mean, the highlights continue, so something's going to happen. We haven't had much luck this year. As of yet. So if you just want to pass it to us, hello, Martial. <gasps> How's he missed? I don't know. I don't know how he's missed that. 17 shots, 2.07 XG to their 0.32. How have they won that, man? That has us dropped down to ninth place. Sometimes you have saves where you're like Arsenal in that game, where you're not very good in some games, but for somehow, some reason, you have that little bit of quality or the, those one chance you, you have, you take. Whereas I feel like we're the complete opposite with that, with that with this Man United team. There'll be lots of games where we don't dominate games. We don't create the chances and stuff like that. And the chances we get, the slim chances we get, will miss, as kind of shown there. But even there, like a game where we deserve to win, we still don't have the ruthlessness or the quality to go and get the job done, you know? And I think that's going to be quite quite a frustrating season for stuff like that. Very much like Man United in real life. Yeah, exactly. Why do you think we can't get Hoyland to, to fire consistently? He's got five goals for us so far from 10 starts. I mean, that's not bad actually, is it, when you say it like that? I just don't feel like he's very good. Maybe maybe that's harsh. Hoyland's cooking for me as a pressing forward. Yeah, we had him as a pressing forward. He wasn't really doing it. Let's switch him back to pressing forward and see if that works. Right, we're going to go for this team against uh, Feyenoord in the Champions League, playing him at home. Sancho, by the way, an absolute resurgence for him to get himself back in the side after being injured. I nearly sold him, remember, at the start of the save, but because he was injured, I couldn't sell him. I own... <laughs> Jump scared by the Champions League music. Oh, we've scored! I don't know how. I don't know. I don't know what's happened. Is it a free kick? Fernandez on the free kick. Whips it in. Is it a Casemiro header? Look at him. Rise highest at the back post. Four defenders he out jumps. That's what he does. A solid first 20 from us. I mean, we should be beating a team like final, but we feel, we feel very much in control at the moment. Oh, what a ball around the corner that is. Rashford's in. If he's got a score then, I mean, literally, he's got half the goal open for him to the right-hand side. We'll be back tomorrow. I think, we, I think we try and go live a bit earlier tomorrow. I'm tempted to go live at like eight, maybe, and just like watch some of the Champions League games. Oh, Hoyland, come on. Now he's cooking. We are so in control here. I am so chilled. Sancho does well to win it back. Fernandez passed into Mason Mount. Slided it through or slid it through to Hoyland. Slided it. That's good, isn't it? Time just run to perfection as well, Hoyland, there. Oh, Rashford. Shoot. Unlucky. We'll make the five changes. We'll get some players from game time. 20 minutes to go. They've barely laid a glove on us, which probably means they're now going to score two, doesn't it, knowing our luck? Ericsson with the corner. He wants to be playing more minutes. There you go. Here's your minutes. Get an assist. There you go. Lissandro Martinez scores a header. I mean, the shortest man on the field just scored a header. We are unbelievably good, aren't we? I need to upload on TikTok tomorrow, really. I'm not... I don't want to leave. I want to do it daily, really, at the moment for the start of FM, but I have already missed that boat. I need to get back on the daily ground, but at very least do one every other day. Alte is an absolute stinker. I don't know. I don't understand how he's dived over the top of that. Martinez is far too uh, complacent to give it away. How, how, how has that physically gone under him there? And there we go. 3-1 winners against Feyenoord. That gives us nine points from 12 in our Champions League group, which means I think we're now... Yeah, look at that. We've definitely sorted out from where we were at the start of the campaign when we lost to AC Milan on the opening day, which now means we're second, only because they beat us. So head-to-head -head wise. But I mean, if we go through second, that, that's fine by me. Oh, we are so annoyingly inconsistent in this save. Sometimes we score four goals. Sometimes we can't have four shots. But with the January transfer winner just around the corner, I think we'll make some moves. Make sure if you enjoyed today's video, you hit that like button down below. And of course, smash the subscribe button because lots of videos coming soon not just manchester united videos some other fm 2014 videos coming as well thank you very much for watching i'll see you soon